to bring in the city uh, a championship that uh, that it that it deserves. Um, you know, obviously we've seen what a challenge it, it is, but I also think this organization is up to the challenge. Um, I think the commit starting with the commitment from Dan Gilbert, uh, the overall organization, business, basketball, everything, really tries to be the best, and that's something that uh, I have been. Uh, continually proud to be a part of. Um, each season presents its own unique set of challenges. Uh, you know, last year we won 60 plus games. Uh, different challenges than this year when we won 60 plus games. When you win that many games, you'd think there weren't, wouldn't be a lot of challenges, but there were. Um, again, I think we did a nice job with handling those throughout the year. Uh, but when we face the challenges that we were dealing with as a team, along with a team in Boston that was playing great and really went after us, uh, we couldn't play the way you needed to play to ultimately be a champion. So, uh, you know, I take that from the end of the season and, you know, going forward, again, talking about just the commitment that this organization has in, uh, in being the best. And uh, you know that that will continue to happen here. And uh, open it up for questions. That more than anything else. Danny Kenny Rode, ESPN Cleveland. You mentioned challenges a number of times. What was the biggest challenge you weren't able to overcome? Uh, you know, I think at the end of the year, uh, you know, we just weren't playing well, and we couldn't find ourselves as a team. You know, we had. The Shaq injury at the end of the year. Um, we had LeBron's situation with his, with his elbow. Uh, and just things in general that we couldn't find ourselves. And you're not going to find yourselves against the Boston Celtics when they're playing the way they were playing. You know, they were not going to do that, allow us to do that. And ultimately, you have to be good enough to, to get through that, and we weren't. Um, you know, what do we learn from that? That's what we're all about to sit down and kind of talk through now. Uh, over the next several days, um, you know, start a review process of, of the year, start the review process of the playoffs, and, and go from there. Danny Tom Withers, AP. Danny, were you troubled at all by, I don't want to call it a lack of effort, or I don't want to question anybody's character down the stretch, but your team just did not have that sense of urgency, that hustle that championship teams have. Is that, does that trouble you a bit? You know, I, I, I don't like how we played at the end. I don't think any of us feel great about it. I don't, I don't know if you want to say it's motivation. I, I, I would pretty strongly argue with you on that. I, I just don't think we were playing well, and I think our guys sensed that. And uh, it's, it's a frustrating thing uh, when, you, when you're not playing at the level that you think you can and at the level we were able to show throughout the year. But at the end of the day, we weren't able to put it together, uh, and you have to be able to. I mean, the Chicago series... We plowed, we got through that, um, but we weren't playing um, to the level near what we were capable of, and I think we all understood that as we were going through it. But we were hoping the longer we could play, the more we'd find ourselves. And, uh, you know, ultimately, playing against Boston, uh, you know, they're a good basketball team, and they took it right at us. And uh, give them credit and acknowledge the fact that... Uh, um, they were the better team, better team than us in that series, and we move on.